I was so rudely interrupted. But where was I at? Hey guys, I'm Lauren Renee and I'm back with another video. I'm back. I'm back. Okay, yeah, I'm back. <laughs> I've been gone for like a little while just because school's been busy for me with uh, doing classes and my dance team and my acapella group. It's just been a lot. It's been a lot, okay? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but I'm here with a highly requested video. A very, very highly requested video, okay? So for all my little senior babies that are graduating this year, I know this video is a little early, but you guys really wanted it, okay? So I'm going to tell you everything you need to bring for college, for your dorm. See, see, not, not supplies. We're not going into that. That's a whole separate video, hon. But we're just... I was so rudely interrupted, but where was I at? I think I was talking about, yeah, except for video, whatever. But um, today's video is just everything you need for like your dorm and to be prepared for dorm life. You feel me? Cause dorm life is not, <laughs> it's not all that, hon. <laughs> so I'm just trying to give you a few tips to make it better. Okay, let's, let's get on to the video. Okay, I'll stop rambling now. <laughs> So, 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 I have a list right here. You can't even see it. It just looks like a white piece of paper. I promise. You can't see it, but I promise there's a whole, you can kind of, kind of, there's a whole list of things right here that I'm going to just read off to you guys, explain a little bit. So we're going to start with big items, and I have a little pencil I need to check off each time I say an item. So, big appliances. We're gonna need a refrigerator, a mini fridge, obviously not, not a big one because nobody has room for that. So a mini refrigerator, either you and your roommate, or if you're having a single, you could buy it yourself. But like usually when you talk to your roommate, you like decipher who's going to buy which item or whatever. So like I bought the, fr uh, no, I bought the microwave and my roommate bought the refrigerator. So yeah, that's fridge and microwave because, um, when you have drinks in your room, you don't want to like go outside because we have a kitchen on our floor. So you don't want to go outside to go get your drink all the time. Sometimes you just want to stay in your room. So that's really nice to have a refrigerator in your room. And then a microwave is very also, very also, it's also very useful. There we go. It's also very useful. Like when you just want to heat up food, like if you have leftovers or maybe if you want to make popcorn. Although I don't really use the microwave a lot in our room because only because the room is so small that when you heat something up, it makes the whole room smell like that and I don't like that. So we like kind of refrain from using our microwave. But if you don't care, then that's like a nice plus. So we got the refrigerator, water bottle. Wait, what? I just gave away something on the list. I guess we'll just go straight to that. That's kind of random, but I really suggest always keeping a case of water in your room only because like here we have mill swipes and we get like a certain amount of money for each swipe but if you have a case of water in your room you could use the money that you're using to buy a water at one of the dining halls just to like get extra food or, or snacks for later so i find that like really useful to have a case of water in here because i'm always drinking water or i try to always drink water so very useful so case of water check all right, now we're gonna go on to like, um, like this stuff, bedding, yeah, whatever. So you're gonna need a mattress topper for sure, for sure, for sure. Honey, I came here for, what is it called? Orientation, and you know they don't have mattress toppers, so you just spend the night here. <sighs> that mattress was so hard. It felt like a freaking cardboard. I was pissed, but it's fine because I have a mattress topper and I got it from Amazon. It's really, really, really nice. If you go watch my um, dorm haul from last year, you'll see it in there. It is bomb. It feels like I have like a really expensive mattress on my bed, but I really don't. And it was only like $30, so it was very affordable. 
I recommend it a lot. So a mattress topper, you're going to need some sheets, um, blankets, pillows. I have, I have a little obsession with pillows. I have one, two, three, four, five, six pillows on my bed that, and I keep four of them on there all the time, but the other two I take off before I go to bed. But yeah, I just love pillows. They make it really comfortable. You know, you know. Okay, so after pillows, then you want to, did I already say sheets and blankets? Probably. Sheets and blankets, but I suggest getting two um, sets of sheets. That way when one of them is getting like old and you need to wash them, or maybe you don't have time to wash them, you could just take those sheets off and put your second set on. That's something I didn't do, so I really suggest that. Okay, so after all, you got your bedding, whatever, da 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 the next thing is a rug. So here at Ball State, I have tile floors and they can be really, really, really cold. So I suggest getting a rug because it just helps it feel more like home and not like you're living in a jail cell because these floors get cold, cold. So yeah, a rug is really useful. I found a really cheap one for $20 literally right before we came at Walmart. And it's like, it's nice. It's gray. It's just a basic rug carpet looking thing. So the next thing on the list are towels and wash rags. And I know somebody watching this video is going to be like, oh, she said wash and not wash. I usually say wash, but like everybody makes fun of me. So I've just been like conditioned to fix it before I say it. So wash rags for Tiara. So wash rags, sorry I went on that little rant, but towels and wash rags are very, very, very essential, okay? I have like a set of uh, five, I think, and that's like really, really good. Even like a, maybe a little more than I need, but it, it's always helpful to have more than not enough. So yeah, towels and wash rags. And then the next thing you want to get is your toiletries, okay? So, like, that goes with shower caddy. I mean, yeah, that goes with getting a shower caddy and then getting things that you need to put in it, like shampoo, conditioner, body wash. I suggest, really, really suggest getting those, if you use, like, bar soap, getting, like, the 12-pack because it lasts so long. And, like, body wash is the last thing you think about, like, needing when it comes to college but like it's very obviously essential so yeah body wash deodorant things like that things of that nature all of those things getting a surplus of that so it'll last you more than just the first couple weeks um yeah and then oh next is a laundry bin okay listen when you're getting your laundry bin do not and i will Stop the video. Do not buy one of those laundry baskets or their little um, cylinder thing that have like the wire in it and it's like net. Don't buy it. I promise you will just don't do it. Okay, because I live on the fourth floor and my friend Tierra has one of those and literally she struggles so much getting her clothes down there because she literally has to pick up the whole thing and carry it downstairs. And it's just too much I suggest getting a laundry bin that has the little wheels on the bottom that you can just pull and roll it makes it so much easier when you're going to wash your clothes I got mine from Walmart and I think it was like $15 so it wasn't that expensive it may have been even cheaper than that but I just do not get the cylinder one it's just it may be cute in the beginning but it's not gonna be cute when you're struggling the uh, thing popping out the side cutting you just don't do it <laughs> okay don't do it so after the laundry bin um obviously you want to get um detergent or whatever for your clothes because very essential um when i first came i had a bunch a bunch of tie pods and i was literally like mom like take some of these home didn't do that because i ran out <laughs> but it's okay i got some um detergent liquid detergent so i'm all good so after that, um, the next thing you want to move into is cleaning supplies. So 
one thing that I didn't buy before coming that I wish I would have is a broom because I never realized in like a room how much dust collects on the floor well not even dust but like just like little strings and hair just all that stuff collects on the on the rug and on the tile floor it just floats around because the tile is so smooth so I really suggest having a rug I mean not a rug a broom and a dustpan to help you clean your floors because nobody likes dirty floors and then um, I have disinfecting wipes hold on one second I'm gonna check off my list okay we're back <laughs> uh, the next yeah, no, we were talking about disinfecting wipes. Disinfecting wipes are a big, big help. Like, if I could choose one one cleaning supplies to take to college, it would be disinfecting wipes because they're so multi-useful. Like, I can literally use it to wipe off my desk, wipe off the, the refrigerator, clean out the refrigerator, wipe off the microwave. Like, it's just really, 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 really useful. So I suggest getting those. Um, paper towel, towels, towels? See, I can't see. Okay. Paper towels <laughs> are something that I wish I would have gotten in the beginning because I find myself like looking for napkins like very often, whether it's doing my makeup or eating my food or just anything. Like, I always need something like that. So, paper towels are really useful, or they would be really useful in the case of going to college. And then. Alright, now, like, those are all, like, the official things that I suggest. These are all, the next things are all just, like, miscellaneous things that people kind of forget about. Maybe, maybe not, but I definitely forgot about some of these things. So, you're going to need an extra charger. I can't tell you how many times, whether it's me or my friends, leave their charger somewhere and like dang my phone's about to die like i feel like i'm always the friend that people come to for a charger because i have like two extra ones so that's really useful because you like you could literally leave it in your friend's room across campus at 10 o'clock at night and you're not about to walk all the way back out there to go get a charger so that's why you have an extra one okay so that's really useful um the next thing is a mirror a desk mirror I use that for like makeup but I understand that not like this is isn't just for girls so like not everybody wears makeup but guys too you can have a little mirror there you know check yourself out but yeah mirror um extension cords extension cords extension cords extension cords extension cords okay listen I have one two three I have four extension cords and I use them all like literally the what are they called what are they called the wall plugins we're just gonna call them that cuz I don't remember what they're called I'm having brain fart but they're literally so dispersed around the room that when you actually need to do something <laughs> there's no extension cord right here so you can't plug it up but if you have it um, See, I'm saying stuff backwards. You guys know what I mean. There's no plugging right there, but if you have an extension cord, you can just trail it around the, the outside of the room and do whatever you need to do. So that's very, very useful. Um, you're gonna need a lamp for your desk to do homework or just to have a light other than the main light up above. Um, storage bins are very, very, very essential because I know for, okay, so as I came to college, I had my winter clothes at home, but as it started to get cooler, I definitely like brung up my winter clothes to college. Yeah. I bring, I can't talk. I was about to stop the video, but I bring... I brung up my winter clothes from home and when they were when my winter clothes were pure I really didn't have room for them in my closet so I just had a storage bin under my bed 
because my bed is locked as you can see so I had it under my bed to keep my clothes um, protected protected kept away whatever <laughs> those are really cheap at Walmart especially around um, going back to school time so that should be good and the last thing the last thing I have on my list is like it's not a necessity but to me it's a necessity and it's decor because if I didn't have this decor I think I, my life would probably be miserable like literally I have some days where I'm just like oh my god I just want to go back to my dorm because I feel at home there like literally it'd be like that sorry the joke's on you college is not what it's all um cracked up to be <laughs> they came out very slow but you got the hint it ain't so decor really helps like ease ease my mind when i see oh, my room is so cute like literally this sounds really dumb but really like when it sets in and i see other people's room and it's not not um, decorated at all I'm just like how like yo I mean no judgment but I'm just saying that's just me I, I like decorated stuff so that's why it was the last thing on my list all right so that was the end of my video of what you need for dorm life in college for all you little seniors that are graduating this year congratulations I'll be doing some more college videos as we get closer to going to school and you know moving in all all the things to expect what not to expect different um ah you know what just popped in my head one last thing that you need hon one last well actually two things kind of but it's along the same lines hon you gonna need some dang shower shoes because ain't nobody about to step in that shower barefoot that's so nasty i've seen somebody do it and that's disgusting but shower shoes and house shoes but not like they don't have to be actual house shoes like literally I have Crocs that I've purchased this year just to wear inside the room because I, I don't wear them outside but like just to wear inside and living my best life living my best life ain't going back and forth with you if you like the video make sure you like the video like actual actually like the video Comment down below where you're going to school next year. If you're going to school, comment down your plans. I want to know what you guys are doing. You feel me? College ain't for everybody. It definitely ain't for me, but I'm here. It's whatever, though. I'm not mad at all. <laughs> okay. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Peace out, y'all. See y'all in the next video.